Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'll be sure to make your very own Minecraft server for free on your own computer. Now the very first thing you want to do is download JDK. You can find this in the first link in the description down below. Select which operating system you have and then download the installer. Now just go through the setup process and then click close. Now you need to install the server jar file, head over to the second link in the description down below and click download Minecraft server in your version number. Now head over to your desktop, right click, create a new folder. Call this whatever you would like, but I'll call it MC server. Now from your downloads, grab server.jar and drag that into your new folder. In that folder now, right click, create a new text document, type in start and keep the rest the same. Now open that up and now head back to that website we were at before where you downloaded the jar file. Go ahead and copy this line. Now head over to our text file, paste that in. You want to change Minecraft server and the version number to just server because that's the file name these two values is how much ram you are allocating to your server in megabytes so this is one gigabyte i recommend doing no more than half your computer's memory i'm going to give my server a generous eight gigabytes of ram so 8192 on both of these now head back over to your folder if you cannot see the file type head over to view show and then file name extensions and now on the start.txt click edit and change that txt to bat and click yes now you're going to want to run that start.bat so double click it it will open up your command prompt after that has finished you'll be left with these files go ahead and double click on eula.txt and where it says eula equals false change that to true and save that now go ahead and run your start.bat again and this is your server head over to minecraft click on multiplayer add server to connect to your local server on your own computer, type in 127.0.0.1, click done, and now click play. And now you're in your server. To give yourself server operator, head over to your command prompt, type in op, and then your in-game name, and now you've been opt. For more in-depth settings, open up your server.properties file inside of your folder. Here you can change the difficulty, the game mode, the max players, we can set that to 100, save that and here you have the MOTD which is the message you see on your server so we can change that to tutorial server and now for any changes you make here to take effect head over to your command prompt close it and run the start.bat file and here you can see we have our new message and our max player count to create a server icon you'll need an image of 64 by 64 pixels so to change my image size i'll just be using this free website called Piscal. i'll link it in the description as well now go ahead and drag over your image that you want to use and resize to 64. click import okay and now we can export download and now go ahead and put that new image into your server folder rename it to server dash icon it has to be called exactly that now restart your server and you'll see we have our new server icon now for other people to join your server you'll need to do what's called port forwarding i have a tutorial on that in the description down below anyways guys i hope you found this story helpful if you have questions or comments please leave them down below and don't forget to like and subscribe thank you